You know, <clears throat> you know what I find funny? Every year at Cannes or other festivals, there's always these posts about this film or so and so got a 14 Teen. minute. Like, who's timing it? <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> and it's every <laughs> year somebody gets some I know. number. Of they a... <laughs> do it. He got a five minute. He got a seven minute. He got a 14 minute. He got a 21 minute. This, this year. And who knows? I... It could be true, but it seems like every single year, this year it was. Johnny Depp got a seven-minute standing ovation. At yeah. Can. Obviously, there's reasons that he would, but it's just, it seems every year there's something that gets some absurd, like, we're going to stand for 14. <laughs> I'm like, I don't, I don't think that's true. And I don't know that that is a definitive example of genuine praise. It's almost like they're going for the record each time, knowing <laughs> this is going to be printed. We need to make this a good one. <laughs> Exactly. They're gonna they're gonna report what kind of an ovation. Unless it was we get. on your Og's film, I guarantee it's a twenty seven minute standing ovation. There's a standing ovation still going on right now somewhere in France over gangs of Wasper. <laughs> Some guy is still. <laughs> Josh! Hey, welcome back to our stupid Rex of Corbin. I'm Rick. You can follow us on Instagram, Twitter for more juicy yeah. content. Thank I saw that too. Time. You know, you know what I love too oh, when sure. Johnny was asked about his his uh, stuff, his stuff, his career, and specifically asked about Hollywood, and his response was, "I don't think about Hollywood." <laughs> more power to you, Johnny. I've seen I've seen some of that. He's such a bad speaker. Like, oh he's, yeah, he's no. Always, like in terms of like yeah. just an orator or whatever. Right, the word is. right. He, uh, uh, I don't, uh, um, uh, um, <laughs> <laughs> yep, that's how he speaks. That's pretty much it. That's how he's always spoken. It's terrible. Yeah. I love him, but it's terrible. He's just always been such a bad speaker. Yep. Anyways, that's not what this is about. No, not at all. Uh, today we got a video. This is called 10 Swinging In, 10 Stunning In Swinger Bold. <laughs> yes. In cricket ever. So I'm, I'm assuming in swinging is kind of like a... Uh, it's it's being a swinger, but keeping it in the family. Yeah. Like they do in the South. Alabama. Yeah. Uh, so it's a specific type of bowl, I'm obviously assuming. In, the kind, in, uh, well, probably the kind I used for my hair when I was four. So probably if a... What is it called? In swinger. What's a what's a, it's a spinner, right? It goes right. here and then it goes out. So maybe it goes here and then goes I, yeah. in towards I'm them. I'm betting an in swinger goes to the inside of the batsman. That's my guess. <laughs> Speaking well, of which, I'm getting excited. All of the Night Rider posts I'm seeing for the LA Night Riders on Instagram. Um, I'm a Punjabi Kings fan. So. Hey, that's all right. I watch none of the games. Is anybody else expanding here to American no. cricket no. that you know of? No. No? I I just love that not only is it Shah Rukh Khan's team and they're coming to Los Angeles, but I love that the original team is in Kolkata. <laughs> Oof. Here we go. <laughs> Gil Christ! Oh, yeah. Yeah, so it was moving in before it hit the ground. So it's already yeah. on the inside, but it, then it swings. It was moving like a slider. Look, it's going in, 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 and it started to cut in on him in flight. That's cool. Figured of what we call substance for some time. That seems like a hard ball to hit. That close. Like, because you have to, like, you can't get a lot of momentum. I just love the way that has kept this thing so that people for a long time agree with the side of views that have lost this fish down. Brett Lee. Everyone catching by one. Yeah. Oh! Moves in. Great pace of Ali. That's just sheer pace. Sheer pace. Standing delivery. That that was quick. I love the Australian accent. Great piece of Ali, Brett Lee, and that's a pair for Sawa. Yes. Wow. See that cut in? How do you hit that? Brett Lee's real happy with that. 
because you have to worry about your feet. Very, very good dismissal of the strains. What is that heart there for? Ah, hit one pixel. Somebody's doing something. <laughs> Couldn't pick up where the ball was moving because of the pixel stuff there. It's so tight on the bowler. I don't know, like, where do you hit that? The ball was never in play for the guy. <laughs> That's that kind of unhittable. I don't know, like... Raffles those stumps. You ha he'd have to go like this. Young Indian sensation. There, did it again. Same movement. Incredible in swinging Yorker. Wow. That seems like one of the hardest to hit balls that I've seen. Absolutely. An end swinger. <laughs> <laughs> Did, yeah, I can absolutely see how all of them have that same movement on them. Yes, it did. Driver looking to hit that through the offside next to That is so tough to That's hit, man. Swing. The one that almost had Bango trapped LBW in brilliant delivery. Look at the late movement here in the air. That really ducked in. Rail driver, whose footwork is usually so assured, was not there. He didn't really get the front foot extended as he would like. He's got to have better footwork. That's what I've been and saying. Obviously, you've been saying that for years. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You want some glow sticks, Corbin? <laughs> I need it for this music. <laughs> they didn't play that one so well. That was a great delivery from Wazi Makram. The in-swinging Yorker hitting the base of the leg stump. You can much He's so defeated. Than that. Yeah, you can see the movement there the too. Going around the wicket. It's late breaking and too. And they have to move their feet. feet. Yeah, it looks like it doesn't start the break until it's halfway to the batsman. So you can't really pick up on it. Till it's too late. No pixels. Oh. Good grief. Shoulder arms. Come back to my look at where it is starting and look where it is now. It's hit the middle and let middle and off. It's an incredible delivery. Can't blame Mitchell Johnson for leaving it. Oh. oh! Beautiful delivery. It's definitely reverse swinging. That is a beautiful ball. And, golf, and I'm sure there's out swing. Today with a, a great reverse there's swing. an in swing. In swing. Clearly, you've got one that's got to go out. Well, that it goes and swings and that way, as opposed to going right. and swings out that exactly. way. Exactly. Yeah. Those look un un just yeah, unbelievable. Yeah, I don't know how you, I mean, obviously, I'm sure people have hit them before, obviously. But, man, did, that looks like one of the tough... Because it's, like, right up on you. And yeah. And it goes in between where your bat usually is and where you are. And so you'd have to... Like, your normal bat swing is here. Yeah. You'd have to go here. Yeah. You have no leverage. It's it's It moves a lot. And it wouldn't surprise me if the grip and the release is similar to a slider in Major yeah. League Baseball because it has the same movement. But the difference being, obviously... The ground, obviously. The <laughs> ground. Because uh, and and some people have what's called you know they have late breaking fastballs where they have a late breaking slider, and what's the challenge with the things? And so many of them were late breaking. It looked like you don't see the movement until it's halfway to the batter. Yeah. And I don't know how you, especially if you start your swing seeing it as one thing, and then you realize halfway to you, oh crap, that's not what I thought it was. You're, you're not gonna have time to adjust. Uh, in swing, the seam is directed towards leg slip. Bowlers lock and open their wrists to get in swing of the highest quality. The same delivery would be an outswinger to a left hander. Outswingers hope to find the outside edge of a batsman, whereas in swingers try for getting the batsman bold or LBW. I, there's a lot of terminology there. I don't, 
understand. Like the seam is directed towards leg slip. I don't know what that means. Well, I know what that means. Do you? Yeah. Okay. Uh, you're just an idiot. That's true. So it's true. Uh, I've never that, denied it. That's why you don't get it. Yep. I get it though, a hundred percent. All I know about a leg slip is when it's raining. I hate when my leg slips. Yeah. Kind of like now because I just realized I have a, a hole in my crotch. Wow. <laughs> is that for uh, easy, access? easy access? Yeah. Uh, not for me. For yeah, of course. Well, for you if you need to pee or Renvere. you want to Renvere. Or if he just uh, shows up. Like exactly. And I've known that for these are the shorts you've said you want to wear when we interview him in person. Yeah. Of course. Um, Who wouldn't? Yeah, that was, those were yeah, that's clearly kind of insane. One of the best things we've seen where we can really understand just by watching the I ridiculousness of what's going on. That. Yeah, and if you did, I'm pretty sure like it'd be like a a, a soft bunt, <laughs> like because like if you did hit it, it'd probably go straight to the guy and then yeah, probably now, get you out. You know what I want to see now is I want to see batsmen taking brilliant in swings like that and actually turning them into something incredible with their hitting. Sachin probably did it. Yeah. Virat Kohli. Yeah. Amos Dhoni. Yeah. The greats, you know. Anushka Sharma. The greats. Tapsi Panu. Yes. She played a cricketer once. Tupika Paragon. Ah, uh, anyways. No, she's bad mitten, remember? I think she's good mitten. <laughs> anyways, let us know uh, what other cricket videos we should react to. Uh, different pitches, that I mean, bowls that we can learn. Like this one, different hits that we can learn, like learning all we can. Yes. Let us know down yes. below. Yes.